Good morning, everyone. Again, it's another Monday. It, they just come right around so quickly. So it's it's nice, though, to be at the start of a new week and have a new beginning and a new chance to um, have a better outlook on life maybe this week. So it's hard to believe, but Lent is already one-third of the way done. It's time to evaluate how you've been doing on your Lenten resolutions. Well, today I thought I need this message probably more than anybody out there, but I need to take it to heart, to heart. But today we reflect on taking the time to soak in God's love and mercy. In our society today, we're always in a mad rush to do everything that we do. We have quick breads, we have, a, we want to take a quick nap, we drink Nestle's quick, we go out for a quick burger at a fast food place, we take a quick shower because we have to hurry to get to work, where we work quickly to meet deadlines. And the list could go on forever. Does that sound familiar? A retreat director once told me, you know, we always say that we're going to go take a bath. She said, why don't you think of that a little bit differently? Why don't we think in terms about giving ourselves to the bath? Really just taking the time to slow down and truly enjoying everything about the bath. There's a South Korean uh, singer, songwriter, author, and her name is Tanya Doko. And she says, just slow down. Slow down your speech, slow down your breathing, slow down your walking, slow down your eating, and let the slower, steadier pace perfume your mind. Just slow down. I thought that that was pretty good, and I love that image of perfuming our mind. Just let it take in the slowness, take in the, the just the moment, and be mindful of God's presence with you. I've been really lucky lately because when I've been taking Lexi, our pooch, out at night and again in the morning right away, it's been nice out and it's not too cold so I can stay with her out there a little bit longer and the stars have been absolutely gorgeous and the moon how it just goes from a little crescent to now it's growing and it, it's just a miracle if you really take the time to slow down and notice things like that it makes your life much more enriched. So our reflection question today is how do we get this way? Why does our world operate at such a fast pace, moving from one thing right to another without taking time to reflect on the last thing that we did? Why do we do that? How do we ever get there? Uh, think of one thing, maybe today, as you're praying with that. What is one thing that you can do today to slow down and admire God's presence in the world? Maybe for you it was taking time to watch Monday Moments and to be with Monday Moments. So we hope that that's the case and you spend a little reflection time. So coming up for us, actually this week is National Catholic Sisters Week. So we celebrate uh, from the 8th through the 14th just the joy of the vocation of, for religious women for, to continue to pray for vocations and to acknowledge and thank a sister for her ministry to the greater church. And then next week is the big kahuna. And starting next Wednesday night, we begin our chapter of elections where we're going to elect our 15th prioress for Sacred Heart Monastery. And whoever is chosen, her title will be prioress elect until June 3rd when she's installed. So it's going quickly and we pray for the sister in our community that will be elected. So if any of you, as usual, have any kind of prayer requests you want to throw our way, we definitely do pray for those, and you will be in our prayers the rest of this week, too. So let us pray. Loving God, we confess our need for you again to help us get out of this cycle of busy. Give us the strength that we need to say no to the temptation of trying to do it all. Help us to slow down and use your wisdom in every decision, allowing you to work out the details instead of us trying to do things all on our own. Help us to remember that all things are possible with you and you are able to do in just a moment what would take us years to work out on our own. We love you and we ask for your spirit to refresh us today. And we ask all these things through Christ and in the power of the Holy Spirit. Amen. So God bless you on this work week and take some time to slow down.